It's Nick Shell, the internet receding hairline guy. I know that last hair video might have left you on a cliffhanger. But you know, it's happening to me again. I'm getting tempted again just to go ahead and, and shave off my hair. I'm, what I'm going to try to do is to, to wait until October because we're going on a family trip and I don't know, somehow looking more professional is something I want to do while there's a big wedding. I don't know. That's kind of a dumb reason when it comes down to it because no one, no one cares about my hair. Uh, but for some reason, that's my arbitrary goal. Now, I do have a road trip, a couple road trips coming up too. I'm like, well, might as well have hair, I guess. But, okay, so everyone uh, that participated in my project said that I basically look my age. So, if I shave my hair, will I look older or will I look ultimately the same or younger? And I've asked that question and basically the feedback, I, well, I even had one guy say that he thought I looked better and younger with a shaved head because it actually uh, distracted even less from my hairline. So it's like... I always say, right, that every advantage is just by going ahead and shaving your hair to number one. And that's the thing, like, I can easily commit to things. I've worked at the same job for a decade. Today actually makes my eight-year wedding anniversary. And again, I know that's hard for some of you to imagine that I'm married and have kids, but I, but that is the truth. That's eight years ago today I got married. So I commit, you know, and I stay committed. But when it comes to hair, I mean, my hair's not able to commit to me and I can't really commit to my hair that's just not my hair's fault because remember I'm not a victim I'm a victor in every situation because I choose to be but with that being said uh you know that's my genes I'm like every uh other man in America I'm uh I I'm losing my hair you know so I accept that but you know it's like man if I just shave it off and I look just as good or just as young why not you know so the temptation's back. I can, every, and it happens every time. When I get hair this long, then I don't even want to get it cut shorter. I just want to cut it all off and start over. So that's where I'm at. I'm just making a video explaining that I am tempted to do that. And I think it's really just a matter of time. How long can I make it? Because my wife doesn't care. Who cares? No one cares whether I have hair or whether I shave it off. No one cares. And if they did, all they would do is have an opinion either way. Oh yeah, I liked it better the other way. Or no, I liked it better this way. How does that affect anything? It doesn't. Because it's all meaningless when it comes to whether you as a man choose to have hair with a receding hairline or choose to shave it off. This is Nick Shell, the internet receding hairline guy.